Fuck you, Donald Trump. You're an idiot. An absolute idiot. Double camera action. Celebrities. Celebrities. Anyway. So here with Josh Irvine. We're heading into Brisbane City uh, just to film a webisode for the come up. Also answer some questions that you people have asked me. Someone asked me what got me into BMX. To keep it like a short kind of answer, pretty much uh, at school I hated team sports. Um, at home I had an abusive dad. I wanted to get away from him. So I got on a bike, started riding around. I started racing. Didn't like that. Too much rules and bullshit that goes with it. Um, and then pretty much just got into doing tricks and that sort of stuff. Going down to my local skate park of Halabar. Uh, and then I met these dudes called the Drain Kids. Everyone thought they were the bee's knees. I think they are a bunch of wankers. Um, reason why is because when I was down in the skate park, obviously I was younger than them. And I always wanted to go ride around with them. And they'd be like, oh, no, nah, man, we're going to secret locations. And I was like, whatever. I was like 14, 13. I was like, whatever. But then I'd secretly follow them just to see where they were going so I could, like, watch what they meant by that street riding. Because back then there wasn't as much social media. There was none, actually. Social media shit. So I'd follow them. And then one day they were at the skate park again. I asked if I could go with them. They're like, yeah, yeah, sure. Went with them. Went for a ride. And they were dickheads, they wrecked my bike and told me I should quit BMX. And then from that day I was like, no, fuck this. I'm gonna ride a bike, I'm gonna fuck it. Go further than you, whatever drain kids, gutter kids you wanna be called. And it just went from there, so that's what got me into BMX. It's now, we're just driving to the city. Sure, I'll run away for to get a coffee. And we're about to drive past the voting people. Vote for Vesta. Ross Vesta. Can you imagine me? PM, Josh Irvine. Would you vote for me to run this place? I think I could run it pretty good. Better than fucking Donald Trump. Change of plan. We decided to stop at Cooper's Skate Park first, then get coffee. So we're gonna get a couple clips here, uh, and then go get coffees from Route 63, I think the cafe's called. So we're here at Coop's. Getting ready to have a roll. Once the fucking bike comes off. Oh shit. I'm ready for my X Games run. I got my mouth guard in so I don't break my teeth and shit. I'm gonna be doing some quad backflips today. Intimidation is the key. Dude, I will fuck you in the bum. Oh yeah, great fucking bike. Oh, you can't. Oh my god! This is ridiculous. No, fuck! You son of a bitch. That's right, we're at Cooperoo. This place is good for warm ups, but I'm not warmed up. It's a webisode, it's about sketchiness. Chink, daily chink. Daily chink for Adam. Daily chink. Wait up, Rena. You there? She can't see you. Hi. So that's Cooperoo warm up. Now I have to go get coffee. Let's go. Skype and talk. Yo. Give me a second, I'll be in the coffee shop in two, like two minutes. I'll be right back and I'm riding past Charlie for two minutes. Thank you so much. Anything for you, sir? Hey? Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go, got it. We're live here on Channel 7. No, I'm just fucking with you. Coffee time over. Now we're off to the city, the Big Apple, Bris Vegas. Uh, kid asked me what bike I ride. Pretty much right now I'm riding a BSD, Alex Donachi frame. Things built pretty good, steep head tube, shorter end, it's a good bike. Just run a bunch of different parts. Got a couple of Primo parts, a couple of BSD parts, and some Fiend pegs. The pegs are good, I'm liking the pegs. That's about it for what I run right now. 
So we just had our coffee, as I said, heading into the city. We just watched our boy out of times edit. What the fuck can I say except, seriously, head to the come up, check it out if you haven't checked it out already. This is fucking amazing. And speaking about out of time, here's a fact for everyone. He's a fucking animal. Check the edit out. We got a tourist. Oh, he dropped his ice cream. My girl. Rolled up onto the aluminium rail. Would you goddamn look at that? The tree. Now, folks, I love trees, but sometimes trees are in our way. It's got a branch in our way. Sorry, tree. Key with aluminium rails, kids. Wax the shit out of the fucker. It's wax time. Wax is a sex art. Rust. 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 Just like stuff, right? pretty much. And for you who are virgins, practice with wax. You ace it first go. Oh, that's it. Yeah, she's wax. I wonder if I actually hang her in. Oh! <laughs> Keep that. Pain is hurting. It's in. <laughs> Fuck! Give me more, I just got ball jack. I got another one. Fuck me. I want to answer that question. Kids always want to know how you get sponsored. Back in my day, there's none of this Instagram, Facebook, just magazines and comps and like word of mouth. The way I first got sponsored is that I had a comp and I got asked. But then after that, I was like, you know, I gotta put myself out there. So I made some sponsor me tapes, which everyone's done. Don't fucking deny it. You know, I got hooked up. But these days, you know, people get sponsored from fucking Instagram, which is, I think is the dumbest thing. I actually believe the best way to get sponsored is send your stuff into brands and stuff like that. If you believe you offered them something or, you know, you're good. And the second you get sponsored, you're gonna work hard. There's people I know who got hooked up from Instagram and they don't do jack shit. The companies don't know their personality. This is me, I'm a hard worker. And that's just what I reckon. And I can cut my hands up. Fuck. Look at sponsorship like a job. You can't go to Macca's and not flip burgers and expect to get paid. You know, you can't just stand there and get paid. Same as sponsorship. If you get hooked up, you need to work. Just treat it like a job. The sponsorship will progress and progress and progress. Believe in yourself. Always stay chill. Be friendly, be nice, stay true to yourself. Don't become a fuckwit to other people who aren't sponsored or aren't as good as you. Yeah, just work really hard. Pretty much it. Oh shit! Once you get past like 25, your knees are just fucking haggard. Coaster engaged. How you doing? But it's all worth it. Let's get something this thing. Oh my god. I'm gonna get the fuck off in that coaster. There's our local hospital. I've been there a few times. Not just for me, my kids. My oldest one, that's eight. I broke a collarbone at five trying to like drop into a nine foot quarter. So the banditos. And... Why do I suck at one eight? I suck at this trick. It's Brisbane. Fuck, there's that sign. This is Bris Vegas. We got our local police officers. We just walk over here to show you Brisbane. That tall dude's a wank. It's Bris Vegas. Saying goodbye to Brisbane. Moving down south. What do I love about Brisbane? I love nothing about Brisbane. So that's Brisbane. Ooh. Doing weather stuff for TCU in Brisbane right now. Hope you like it. Oh shit! Oh, oh god. That's fucking out. 
Whip gang's not strong. Fuck off, dickhead. Let's go. Do you want? Are you there? Pretty much. Been filming around Brisbane. Last two spots. Crashed both times. Now we're having some Japanese lunch. Shit's good. What do you like about America? I just like going to America because riding scene's totally different to Australia. It's much cooler. Cruise, click, they all hang out. And the spots are the fucking best. Anyway, so after we finish this, I'm gonna cruise around somewhere in the city. One thing about Brisbane, no spots. They're all pretty much capped. Fucked. Hopefully we find some spots. Can't all be like fucking me. Place for the gardens, the trees. Stop it! You go. Alright? Fuck! I just I'm gonna one eighty it. Fuck I love trees. So pretty much as rolled around today around Brizzy. Stopped a few skate parks, or one skate park. Showed you guys Brisbane. You know, it's a good place if you want to come ride. There are spots, not that many, but it's pretty fun. Uh, thanks for all your questions today as well. I got another question from a young dude. Uh, how long have I been riding for? Way too long, and I'm still shit. Check out the webisode, and follow the come up, and the come up on YouTube, and follow me on Instagram. It'll pop up right here, Josh underscore Irvine 86. Have fun.